Hi guys, this is Tracy from Lavinia Stamps and welcome to another tutorial today. A tutorial with a difference because we have now launched our brand new Christmas stamps, which we are all really, really excited about. I've got the lovely star here. Now I'm going to be creating this card today using star. And I just wanted to show you a real simple way of using her. She's a real standalone stamp. So all you need actually with something like this is a little bit of color. And it can be a nice, clean, sharp card. Of course, if you want to add loads of color to your background, that's fine too. But today I'm going to create this. Let's just pop that over there. Now, first of all, I'm going to ink up in the Versafine. And the reason why we ink up in the Versafine is because of the detail. This ink is like no other and it just grabs every bit of detail. And then we're going to pop her down around about the middle of the card. Now, you know the rules with um, silhouette stamps. Just give it a little bit of patience. Okay, so just let that stamp rest on the card. It's got a lot of detail. And there she is. That's great. So I have got some uh, lovely pens here. These are our clean colour. We do, I think, 8s, 12s, 24s, and they go up. I've just picked a few of my favourites here, and I'm going to use these now to colour her in like this. Starting with a nice light colour. I always find that that's the key, because we can blend any other colours in with the lighter colour after and it does blend much nicer so let's put the base down first and then put a little bit of blue And as I say, if that blue is a little bit strong, then just go back to your lighter colour again and you can blend that out. And let's follow those lovely stripes on her hat. Now it doesn't take an awful lot to be honest as I say to just create something so simple but it looks so effective. Okay, let's have a look. That's a little bit dark. Just want a bit of colour for her hair. And as I say, I'm just keeping it nice and light at the moment. And then I'm going to bring in a bit of orange or a bit of pink. I might just have a little bit of the pink just for that contrast. That works well. And then that gorgeous bright lemon yellow. Add a little bit of a glow around the light there. Put a little bit of orange in the middle. Blend that out. So 
got a glow in her lamp. I am going to use our glitter Posca pen here. This is our orange. You can use whichever colour that you like. And I'm just going to dot in and around her over the top all around dots are great are great to create that little bit of magic and it just finishes off the card really nicely okay so lastly i'm going to use our quickie glue pen and put some tiny, tiny little dots just over her skirt. And then we'll add a little bit of the holographic glitter, which has got um, an amazing sparkle on it. But I don't want it to be too overpowering. So that's why I've only put that little bit on her skirt. that back in and now all we're going to do is just use our words if you haven't got these words you can use whichever words you like I'm just using the Christmas ones but equally this could be a birthday card it can be a any time of the year card I'm inking up again in the Versafine and then pop that down just above. Give that a good press. I'm actually amazed that I haven't got any ink on, although I shouldn't speak too soon, should I? I am just going to pop a few little words down here. Let's have a look, what can we pop? Pop down. Lots of really lovely words. things love this so you can see I've used two different kinds of colors here and equally they both look lovely I hope that that's inspired you to have a go yourselves a really nice quick easy card to achieve thanks so much for joining me guys you take care and I'll see you soon bye for now